Hi, I'm Doug Holtzaken, President of the American Action Forum. You're going to be hearing a lot from President Obama and others about plans to create jobs. How can we evaluate those plans? Here are four principles that you should look for in any good jobs plan. Principle number one, no U-turns. One-time stimulus has proven to be ineffective, and it is impossible for Congress to turn things on and turn things off in a timely fashion. We can't run the economy from Washington, and we shouldn't try. No more U-turns. Number two, focus on businesses. Businesses in the end, small, medium, and large businesses, will hire Americans and give them the standard of living they need. You can't do that with a check. You can't do that with any one-time policy from Washington. So the policies have to focus on business. Principle number three, attack the debt explosion. The United States is careening directly toward a sovereign debt crisis. There is no more anti-jobs, anti-growth policy than to continue down this path. So any plan to create jobs should include a plan to reform entitlements and reduce the long-run debt. And principle number four, eliminate uncertainty by future policy. The best policies would be permanent tax reforms that made us grow more quickly and compete better internationally. Entitlement reforms that took off the table the threat of a debt explosion. If we can't get permanent reforms, there should be a clear timetable toward completing any changes so that businesses know their future and can make plans and hire accordingly. So those are four principles by which to evaluate jobs plans. You're going to hear a lot of them, but now you'll be able to grade them.